Frontier League Cross Country Championships were held yesterday in Carthage. South Jefferson showed how strong that program has become, especially on the girls' side. South Jefferson dominated the girls' race as the Spartans took the team title. South Jefferson took five of the top six spots, with eighth grader Ellie Roberts leading the contingent in a time of 19 minutes, 11.4 seconds. Annabelle Renzi finished second behind Roberts. Amalia Netto and fellow Spartan Lillian Coda finished third and fourth respectively. Reese Roberts placed sixth, an outstanding performance across the board. I feel like it was a good race for all of us on the team. Our team has done very well this season. It was a lot of fun. I was happy with my performance. I was really proud of the team. I think we all performed really well, and it was just a lot of fun. I thought it was really fun. I'm usually I'm usually not that high up, but I thought it was really fun. It was a great experience. Oh, yeah, for sure. I mean, I'm usually not that far up front, and it was such a, like a different change of scenery for me, and all the girls just performed so well yesterday. Yeah, I was happy with my race. It was a really muddy course and <laughs> it was tough to go through the weather, but I was happy with how I did. The Spartan success continued also on the boys' side as Henry Christman won the individual title in a time of 16 minutes, 13.8 seconds. Christman, a freshman who showed maturity beyond his years. I definitely knew I could get top three. I knew that Carthage and South Lewis had some fast guys and I was just focusing on leading it like from the start and not making it a uh, finish at the line and just to hold it the whole way through and then finish like with a big lead. Spartans coach Justin Crossway obviously happy with the results but also happy that the team learned something from the experience. You know getting through those hurdles those next steps um, was a good uh, eye-opener and learning curve for the whole team. Um, I think great day overall performance wise as teams, as individuals, um, but also a lot of those like hidden moments, learning experiences where uh, kids will realize, you know, positional running is very different than PR running and hitting your best mile splits. There's a lot of components um, in the post play that can't always be taught at the, the earlier meets and the invitationals when you're first getting exposed to the sport. And I think we had a lot of great teachable moments with the program yesterday um, and gave us some steps for growth uh, for the next couple of weeks to come. Up next for the Spartans, preparing for the sectionals November 9th at Mount Market.